So are you hashtag team Vanessa or hashtag team Raven? Either way, you should come out to watch tonight's Bachelor finale with myself and Leslie from 1063 mm -hmm. The Groove because it is always so much more fun to watch the finale when you're with your girlfriends. Exactly. Yes. Because we can dish out all the stuff that's going on. Okay, because I felt like I was in a room full of my girlfriends last time <laughs> we did this uh, with Ben. Yes. Wait, we did it with Ben. We did it with... Uh, Jojo? Jojo was the last one. And, we now, did we're, and now we're doing. I, it's so much fun. It is so much fun. I know, because we're all big fans. Yeah. And we want to see what happens. And there's stuff that happens in between that when we get on the mic and talk yeah. about what just happened. And there's there's Team Vanessa, there's Team Raven. Yeah. I also am curious to see how many people uh, really liked Corinne this season. She yes. was the most, I think, talked about person on the show this past season. So. You we'll know see. What? I know. And <laughs> you've been telling people. I've been telling people that Nick will be with us on The Bachelor tonight, uh, watching at our finale party, and you just saw him. Look, he's making an appearance he is. in the morning, Glenn. He he's is. really busy, but he's decided to stop in. He stopped taking selfies with me, and he decided <laughs> to be there for a little while. He came shirtless <laughs> and everything. Good job. Good job. Yeah, Nick. so you can come down and get your picture with Nick tonight. You know what? Just like uh, last season with JoJo, it was funny because a lot of people actually were still fans of somebody that had already been kicked off. Right. So I think that might be the case tonight. Um, but it's fun. It's the finale party, like we said, we are down to Vanessa and Raven. Correct. So we know that. And everything kicks off at 7, right? Everything kicks off on 7, right here on Kagan 9 yep. on your side. Uh, he, they meet his family. Uh, and, and what we don't know is... Will he actually pick one? Because one of your guesses was that he doesn't pick anyone. Or if he does, they don't get engaged. That's my pick. Okay. My pick is that I think that he may choose a woman, but he's not. He's going to say, I, I want to see where this goes and, and develop it more before I actually give you a ring. And I want it to come from my heart. That's my pick. But you had a completely different pick. I did. I, I like, I think Raven is the better of the two. I, but the problem is I really like them both. But I tend to, I think Raven edges out Vanessa. I, I believe that Vanessa's the, the popular vote. I've, I've heard of her name from the beginning about this whole thing. Yeah. I like them both. But I'm like, you know, I just, I get antsy. I'm you like get excited. antsy. I am. I'm excited to find out what happens. And will the fact that they're meeting his family maybe change his views? Right. Because that family is very important to him, so I'm right. curious to see. We saw one of his father tell him, and we don't know which girl he's talking right. about, that this is the type of girl you've dated in the past. It's never worked out. Ah. So, of course, they make it look like it's one, uh, you know, another person, and it's not. You know, it's either Vanessa or, or Raven, and you just trickery of how they do the show. You can never tell. The editing is amazing for this very show good. because they always make me go, "What? That's not what you showed me." <laughs> I am curious, though, for After the Rose, though, because Nick is not slowing down. He's right. on Dancing with the yeah. Stars, which debuts next week. Yep. When is he going to have time to actually have a relationship? So I'm even curious if maybe on the After the Rose, are they still together? Right. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Maybe, maybe who knows what can happen. So when you come out to watch uh, the finale party with us, so this is what happens. You come out, we all uh, get in the room together, and we watch it on a big screen together. There's a bunch of TVs, and we'll all be on the volume. No one really talks. Uh, it's quiet during that. And uh, there's some gasps sometimes, yeah. depending on what happens. And in between is when, during commercials, is when we'll come on and talk to everybody. We've got some fun prizes to give away, and we'll talk about some, do we'll have some fun trivia with Bachelor and stuff that we do in the past, you know, with, I think it'll be fun. This is a great way to kind of end the season with everyone. You come and take your selfie with Nick, uh, our shirtless Nick. Oh, good, right on time. Nice. Was talking about the shirtless, uh, shirtless Nick. He's got that smirk on his face. It, you know? it is. That's the, the <laughs> Nick, Nick Wiles smirk. But we watch the show and then we watch uh, the After the Rose. Correct. And then, like you said, during commercial breaks, we give out prizes, we play games, we have have some drinks. Come out with the There's ladies. There's some great drink specials. They're going to be doing yeah. special for The Bachelor. I think they might have some, some fun names for some of them. Yeah. There may be some roses out that we will be handing out as Aww. well. I think that's, that's <laughs> That's so awesome. But this I is know, the, the great way to kind of, and you're going to come back tomorrow and then we're going to dish on what actually oh, yeah. happened. Yes. Because after the rose, we'll, we'll get to, to talk to, well, we won't, but they talk to whoever was not mm -hmm. chosen. And like we said, we already know who the next Bachelorette is, and it's neither of them. No, it's Rachel. So I will actually be curious to see if the one that doesn't get picked is, feels a little jilted. That I know, because I think any of those three could make a good bachelorette so well gentle bends tonight we'll yes. be out there uh early but yes. seven o'clock is when it kicks off correct come early get a table
Yes, definitely. You can RSVP at 1063thegroove.com. Yes, call all your girlfriends <laughs> now. Text them now. Make plans. You're invited to the final rose ceremony tonight at Gentle Bends on Main Gate Square. We're both going to be out there. For complete details, just visit 1063thegroove.com.